In this video, I'm gonna show you step-by-step step how to download and install DaVinci Resolve so you can start using it right away. My goal is to make the installation process as simple and easy to understand as possible, so I really hope this video helps you out. Yes, this is a super basic video, so if you already have DaVinci Resolve or you've installed it in the past, this video is probably not for you. And very soon I'm gonna be releasing a DaVinci Resolve for beginners video, so to stay in the loop and see that when it comes out, subscribe to our channel. Now, let's get to installing. First, go to your web browser and search DaVinci Resolve 19 and click here on Blackmagic Design DaVinci Resolve 19. Scroll down and you'll see the option to download the free version or buy the studio version, which if you are a pro editor or you're aiming to start getting paid for your editing work, I highly recommend because it has a ton of useful features. If you wanna learn more, check this video out. Otherwise, to download the free version of Resolve, Click on free download now, which will bring up this window with a few different options. So on the left side, we have the free versions of either DaVinci Resolve 18.6, which is the last version of Resolve that was released, or the latest DaVinci Resolve 19 beta version. Now the beta version is gonna have the latest and greatest of DaVinci Resolve, but it might be a little unstable because it's still in beta. Personally, I like staying up to date with all of the new stuff coming out in DaVinci Resolve, so I choose beta. And to be extra safe, whenever I upgrade, I make sure I've saved a backup of all of my projects. If you wanna learn how to do that, let me know in the comments below. Okay, and on the right side of this window, we have the paid studio versions. If it says studio in the name, that means it's paid. Also, depending on your operating system, you would choose Mac, Windows, or Linux. I'll click to download the free version for Mac. You're gonna be asked to fill out your whole life story. Just kidding, it's just a little bit of info. And you can then click on register and download on the bottom right. When this window pops up, click on this DaVinci Resolve 19 zip file and your system might save it by default to your downloads folder. My computer asks me where I'd like to save it, so I'm fine with my desktop. Click save. And now it's gonna take some time to download. While you're waiting, I highly recommend you check out my 14 tips video because there are a bunch of things you might not know how to do in Resolve that are easy to learn and apply and can save you tons of time and your sanity. Check it out if you wanna learn some time-saving tips. Once Resolve's downloaded, you'll see a zip folder wherever you saved it. On a Mac, you can just double click on the zip folder. On a PC, I believe you can right click and choose extract all. Okay, and now we have this DaVinci Resolve DMG file. And on a Windows, I believe it would be a .exe file. You can delete the zip folder, double click on this file to open it up. Click on install DaVinci Resolve, continue. Make sure you thoroughly read every single word of this stuff. Does anyone actually ever read every single word of this stuff? Do whatever you're comfortable with. I just click agree and move on. If you see a pop-up window that says, in order to install Resolve, you must install these components, you can just check mark them and hit install. So this will take 5.67 gigabytes of space up on my Mac. You can change the location you'd like to save this here if you'd like install and you might need to enter your password this will take a few minutes to do its thing and in the past uh, when it's finished it's asked me to restart my computer so if you see that prompt it's fine to restart okay and the installation was successful so we can close this window too and we can delete this dmg file or exe file we don't need it anymore go up to the search bar type in davinci resolve Click on it to open it up. It might take a minute. And here we are ready to start editing. Now that Resolve's installed and you're ready to start working, I highly recommend you check out this video next, which is gonna give you some great timeline tips to make editing a lot easier and more efficient. If you wanna know the gear that we recommend and use or our favorite music for video projects, check out the description below. We have over 200 tutorials on our channel and we release new ones every week. So to stay in the loop, subscribe. I hope you have a lovely day and we'll see you in the next video.